What is up all my gamers? Expert Thief here, but you can call me Expert, and I just got Crisis 2 from GameStop, and this is my first match. I'm playing on a map called Terminal, and you can see the little perk, the uh, kill streaks are called Strategic Tools, our Maximum Radar, Radar Jammer, and Maximum Nano Suit 357 dog tags to get those. Let's see if I can get them. Let's see if I can get some dog tags, guys. Um, I'm using, I don't know if they're called perks or not. I'm just going to call them perks until I look through the instruction manual and find out the correct term. But the perks I have are proximity alarm, which lets you know when enemies are near you. Blind spot, which makes you invisible to enemies' maximum radars. And I'm using, the last one I'm using is enhanced aiming or something like that, which decreases the recoil when you aim down the sight, which is good because... Um, I need my gun to be straight when I'm shooting at people's faces. Anyway, I'm, I'm playing on a map called Terminal, and it's a pretty cool map. It's kind of small, closed in, and there's a lot of firefights in the middle, but there's also a lot of different hallways and rooms on the outside like I'm in right now, so you got to be careful because you might run into somebody that's cloaking up, waiting to kill you. But yeah, um, there's a smashed up train in the middle of the map. I don't know too much about this map or the game yet because remember guys, I just got this game first match. So I'm just relaying some information that I learned while playing in this particular match. I forgot that dog tag, but luckily people can't steal yours in this game. Oh, just got shot. But yeah, I am enjoying this game so far. I'm a, I, I really like games that have like really good graphics. But, you know, graphics aren't everything, so I like games that have really good graphics, but also really fun gameplay. And this definitely delivers on that, because the gameplay is, like, really, really fun. It's just fun to shoot people and get the dog tags and, like, all the different little skills you can use. And then the graphics look, like, beautiful, so you got really nice maps and environments to play on. So I'm liking it. I'm liking it. I just slid on the ground a little bit, do a little bit of a Neo slide. Um, also, I changed my controls and the options, so it's more, like, tactical, because... In Call of Duty, I use tactical to play on. So if you want to do that and make your controller like uh, tactical from Call of Duty, just go to the options, settings, and then controller and change it to, I think it's called alternate or alternative. And uh, that'll switch your melee and your knife so that you'll melee with B and you'll crouch with the right stick. So you'll feel right at home in good old Crisis 2. But yeah, um, if any of you guys got Crisis and you're playing it uh, let me know what you think of it I think it's a really good game I'm having fun so far it looks like they cleaned a lot of things up from the beta so it's working actually and it's not like all glitchy and weird I haven't I mean this is my first match so I haven't played that much but I haven't run into any like I haven't run into any problems if you're thinking about getting the game um, you should definitely like rent it or you know try it out somehow borrow from a friend you know because I think it's definitely worth playing because I I don't know I just really like this game there's just a uh, an addictiveness to it that I, I don't know. I'm, I got pretty excited. I, and after playing the beta, I wasn't really that excited for the game, but as it got closer, I just got more and more excited. I'm like, you know what? I want to get this game. So I uh, picked it up. Headshot. Yes. That guy just got it. Give me that dog tag. It's mine. That's what I thought. That's what I thought. But yeah, as you guys can see, everybody is kind of running around. They don't really know what they're doing because this game just came out. Nobody knows the maps. So, I mean, there's no real strategic positions going on on this map, really. But uh, luckily from the beta, it actually carries over some of the stuff. Like, it carried over my rank. It carried over my custom class. I don't know if it carried over all my attachments and stuff. But um, I got... I don't know if... Is every copy of Crisis 2 a special edition or whatever? Because they gave me a special edition, and it gave me, like, a code to get a skin for the scar and, like, some other crap. So, if you know the answer to that question, let me know. Is every copy of Crisis 2 special edition, or did they just accidentally give me special edition, and I'm like, yay, lucky? I feel like it's just everybody gets this, but anyway... Moving right along, when people's armor is glowing like that or green stuff happens to be coming out of them when you shoot them, I'm almost positive that means they're using the left bumper armor. Um, I figured that out in the beta and I'm pretty sure that is still true. So yeah, if you're wondering why is that person like glowing green, I think it's because they're using the left, bu left bumper armor. So yeah. Uh, the cloak looks a little bit different in this game. It kind of like has grids around it. I don't know. It looks a little bit different from the beta. I remember but I mean the beta was kind of a little while ago so I don't remember everything but 
I do know that guy's about to get killed by my pistol skills. Yeah, give me that dog tag. All right. I got my maximum nano suit. I have no idea what this does yet. I think it just pimps out your suit and gives you like high defense and some other crap. I, I don't know what it does because I'm new. I'm a noob. I'm a noob. But uh, it's pretty cool. As you can tell by the music, the match is winding down. That's what it does when it winds down. It goes, da -da 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 -da. gets all intense. More dog tags for me. But yeah, it's for my first match, I, I did pretty good and I, I had some fun. So it was nice. It has some other game types. I was playing the Team Deathmatch or Team Instant Action. There's also regular Instant Action, which is like free for all. Then they have their version of like search and destroy with one life and a bomb and capture the flag. So uh, as I unlock more game types, I'll upload more. But I am enjoying Crisis 2. I hope you guys enjoyed the gameplay. Please rate, comment, and subscribe. And I will see you guys when I see you guys. Peace. Oh, also I want 11 and 5. Not too shabby. Not too shabby. But uh, yeah, peace.